Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing my Erin Condren plan with me and this is just look back at my last week. I used the Planning Roses All You Need kit and I thought it was a perfect start to all the Valentine's Day spreads um, and I did lots of gold foil which looks very very pretty. But let's move into this next week here which you guys are probably like why is there stuff on the page? Um, <laughs> so this week I'm using this little paper prints kit that I got a while back and I realized while pre-planning that I got the mini kit which didn't have glitter headers or date cover-ups which are two things that I usually use. So I had a minor freak out because I also didn't really have anything that matched this kit in the department of date cover-ups. <laughs> so I wanted to try and figure something out before I started filming just in case it went horribly wrong. Um, so what I ended up doing, I'll just talk to you guys about it, um, is I used these Let's Planet dates, like the actual words because I didn't have any of the numbers left. And then I used some of these Stella Bow um, foiled flags. And then the little date dots are from the Scribble Prince Co. Wiggle It Wednesday. Um, I, I forget what she called this. Was it like raspberry or something? I don't know. It's like the really bright pink, um, which is the foil that I'm using this week. Um, and I wanted to use those date dots, but I just didn't really know what to put them on. So this is what I came up with. I don't hate it, but I'm also worried about how it's going to look with everything else. This flag is from the kit. I just put it there because I had to put it underneath. But yeah, so there's all that. Next, I guess I should talk about, well, I already put on my overlays and stuff, which are from the Scribble Prince Co. sheet, and then um, the glitter headers, that's the word, that I'm going to be using are from Stella Bow as well, and I'm going to be using some different ones. I have one sheet from the Neutral, one sheet from the Rainbow, and one sheet from the Winter collections of hers, and I think I'm doing this pink this red and then this pink right there so yeah we're gonna see how this goes I don't know how well it's going to go but I'm certainly gonna try my best <laughs> um, and then I have everything else so I'm just gonna put the basics down first and then we'll get into all the other stuff Right, guys so there is all of that a little bit of a train wreck not gonna lie but that's okay we'll see how it turns out I'm trying to not judge things before I see it all played out but I used the uh, simply gilded once more with love like collab washi just because I thought red was a good match I didn't really have any pink foil washi um, but then I put the glitter header overlays on but they're bigger than the Stella bow glitter headers by like the teensiest bit so some of them you can see it go over a little bit so I don't know we'll see we'll see anyways let's do some little things so I have these all planned out I used the work scripts from Scribble Prince Co um just just because I wanted to I felt like it <laughs> I'm mixing in gold foil along with the pink foil um just because I know that there's some like I needed to choose flags that had foil in it and if I want to do other types of washi or anything like that, I needed I needed something. So that's what that is. Um, let's put this stuff down here. So Monday, there's three TV shows. Good Doctor isn't on this week, um, which I don't know why, but it's not. Um, I also used two different colors to fill everything out. I used um, red pens for the light pinks. And then I did black for the red and hot pink just because the red didn't 
the red pen didn't really show up on those two colors. So we're kind of mixing things up. My glam planner bill is due. I need to post my full spread. It's currently Monday right now, and um, I don't know how much of this is going to get done, but that's fine. <laughs> I'm being nice to myself, at least I'm trying to be. And then I work today. Um, and then Thursday, Thursday, Tuesday, Ellen uh, Game of Games is on. So we'll put that in. And then Wednesday, I have work and my Cress Press bill is due. So I'm gonna put these in. And hopefully I don't have to work late on Wednesday, but I might, I'm not sure yet. Um, and then Thursday, actual Thursday, uh, we have Grey's Anatomy. I need to post my midweek spread and um, it's Obsidia's birthday, who is one of your guys' dogs. Um, so, happy birthday to you. I celebrate my own dog's birthdays, and I think one of you commented on a video where I talked about it, your dog's birthday, so of course I'm gonna give your dog a shout out, because I love animals. <laughs> um, and then Friday I work as well, so we'll put this in up top. And then Saturday, SNL is on, and then it's my friend's daughter's birthday, so I need to make sure to text her. Um, so we'll put those in. And then on Sunday, I have another build due, Simply Gilded is due. This is one of the first times that I've had all three of these builds due in one week, and it's gonna happen again in March because, um, like, the week structure is the same because February, February only has 28 days. Um, and I ran out of TV little things, so I had to make one for John Oliver on Sunday. So that is that. Let's go ahead and do the sidebar real fast, which I also had to get creative with. I, I don't know what I was thinking. I obviously did not prepare very well for this spread. Um, so I have this as the quote box. Um, cause it had a quote on it. I love you a latte. And we'll put that in. And then I wanted to use as much of the wiggle as possible. So I did an asterisk for my dental habit tracker instead of like the actual dental icon that I usually use. And I think I'm going to do some washi in between this stuff. I have all my Simply Gilded washies here. I think we'll do the confetti. Um, it was kind of hard to match some of the washi to this spread because it's mostly really light. So, just trying to find stuff that matches. That um, striped washi that just came in the most recent mystery box, the March one, the lucky one, that matched really well, so I have to find a good spot to use that in. Um, but I'm excited because I think this week there will be a lot of space for washi since I'm not doing a whole lot, I think. At least I hope. Um, so there's that. And then I have this Happy Meal tracker. So I kind of want to do the bows that I was just talking about, the stripes especially since it's red. And then because this is the mini kit, I only had um, one option for the weekly tracker. Um, so I decided to go back to my roots of the Scribble Prince Co. Um, video tracker little label things, <laughs> but I'm putting them in the sidebar this time, which I've never done that before, so I don't know how well it's going to work, but I kind of like the idea of it because then I still have a spot to mark if I've um, edited, filmed it, uploaded it, you know, all that stuff. Um, but then it's not in the day, so it doesn't take up as much space, if that makes sense. I, I just like the idea of it. So I might be doing it more, especially if the kit doesn't have a weekly tracker or two, 
or if I have the colors to match it because that's the other thing that's difficult about the SPC video trackers is I've used a lot of them and because she's not coming out with new ones anymore um, there's a lot of like colors that I use most of the time <laughs> that I don't have anymore um, okay what should we put is this gonna fit is the first question um, this is not the most scientific way well I guess it should work um, let's put in like this super teeny tiny little thing. This is actually rose gold foil, but I'm hoping no one's gonna notice. <laughs> these are like the little stars. I think these came in the Northern Lights, um, box. Is that what it's call called? Or North Star or something? Something of that nature? Um, but yeah. So, this video supposed to go up on Monday, but I don't know. I had a, I had a tough weekend, um, so I gave myself a little bit more downtime than I probably should have, but I greatly appreciated it, so that's important. And then, um, I'll have my rewind video go up at some point. I'm gonna do another haul, because I really couldn't think of anything else to do. Um, Ugh, I don't know if this is gonna fit. Oh, it will, it will, okay. I feel better about that. It has to overlap a little bit. So I'm gonna do like a super small haul and then hopefully my school video will go up on time. It all depends, who knows anymore. Um, okay, so there's the sidebar. I don't really have anything to fill out right now. All right guys, so it is the next day, so I'm sorry if I totally forgot what I've talked about or what I've said, but <laughs> let's move on to Monday. Um, now I know what's happened both Monday and Tuesday, but let's just, let's move on. Um, okay, so the first thing on Monday, I didn't have, I didn't have class, but I had to go to campus because I had a project that I needed to do. And the reason why I didn't have class was because my professor had his baby, so um, I have like two weeks off from that class, which is really nice, but also kind of stressful because now I have that as an online class, which is no fun. Um, so now I need to figure out when I'm going to do all of that homework. <laughs> but let's do... Also, the foil started to come off of this works label thing, and I don't really know how, um, but I'm trying to be delicate with it. Anywho, um, let's do, I think we'll do like an appointment label. I think that'll be good for the coffee run. So because I didn't have to be there for a class, um, I went and got coffee with my mom beforehand, um, which was nice because we haven't done that in a while. We used to do it every Tuesday and Thursday last semester because we had the time, but now that my semester's changed, we don't get to do that anymore. So we did it Monday, because I still had to be awake, but I didn't have to be there <laughs> um, as early, so we'll put that in. Um, and then um, after I did my project, I came home and I had a little while until I had to go get my shots. And for shots this week, I think I want to do the flags, because I think they're pretty. Um, so let's do the red. And we'll put that here. And then I have my um, fox and cactus um, little girls and scrubs. And we're going to do the pink one. I'm going to need two of these this week, so I'll just take those off. And I've like moved up in how much of the serum that I'm getting. <laughs> I love when I say serum, it just sounds like it's something like science fiction-y. Um, anyway, so I've like moved up in how much that I get. And so I'm like bruising a lot more now, which is just great. Um, and then in the evening we had family night. So I actually think that I'm going to use some of the Simply Gilded Washi. I'm going to do this like marble one as opposed to doing the washi that comes in the kit because 
the washi that comes in the kit is very picturesque like it's just the full box patterns just cut up so I think it would look funny to put something in in the middle of some of these washies so we're gonna do some simply gilded washi that's not a bow and cut that there and we watched bachelor which oh man no spoilers but it's a lot if you oh that's crooked if you haven't seen it I highly recommend that you see it um, and the next episode looks like it's gonna be another just train wreck so that's always fun um, okay but for that I have my gold foil family night stickers from Magic Prince Co so we'll put that in and then that was it for Monday and then moving on to Tuesday which is today um, I had school so nothing really happened in the morning and then I had my appointment so I think that I'm actually gonna put in some washi up here or should I put it down here um, I think I'll put it here so I'm gonna do where did I okay I'm gonna do this little like swan washi I used this last week on the bottom washi this was in the um, advent calendar I believe but I just think it screams Valentine's Day so <laughs> we're gonna use it while we can so I'll put that in here just to space everything out because like I said now I know what happened today <laughs> um, I can just finish this up um, okay so the first thing that I'm going to mark is my appointment even though that didn't happen like first thing <laughs> Um, it's like the first thing that I have to mark. So we'll put in this alarm clock and I think we'll do a quarter box. I'll do a pattern. We'll do it in here. And I think there's still going to be room to put like a piece of washi or something because, um, after that, on my way home, I stopped and picked up my Valentine's Day present for my Valentine, so that was fun. Um, how do I want to mark that, though? I have this little, like, shopping bag icon that I think I'll put here. And just, it took me, like, 30 minutes because I knew exactly what I wanted, <laughs> but... Um, so we'll put that there. And then I guess we'll do the red... Cause why? Oh well, no, because we used both of those. So I think I'll do the skinny gold bows. These are the only two bows that I have in the spread, which is very different. Usually I have a lot of bows and not a lot of patterns, um, so it's different having a lot of patterns as opposed to a lot of bows. Um, okay, so we'll do that. And then the only other thing that I'm going to mark is that I'm watching... Um, I'm like binge watching the OJ Simpson, um, what is it called? American Crime Story is like the series, but they did OJ Simpson and they did Versace and I didn't know that the two of them were linked until I watched the Versace and then I realized it said second season and I was like, wait, what am I missing? And I realized it's like an American Horror Story type of thing where each season is like a separate story and then I got really excited because they're doing a season next that's um what's it called it's like uh, what is that five days at memorial i think it is i think is the book um but it's about the hospital during hurricane katrina who um like there was some questionable ethics that went down um i actually got that book for christmas and so I'm hoping to read it before that show comes out um, so that I can read before I watch the show because now I'm obsessed with this series. Okay, but I'm going to use this little um, circle icon again from the Wiggle It Wednesday to mark binge watching all the shows. And I think that's it for Tuesday. Um, 
Wednesday. The only thing that I'm going to mark is my shot, so I need another um, flag. We'll do, I guess, this pink. And we'll put it on this side. And then put in the fox and cactus girl. And Thursday is Valentine's Day. Oh my gosh, this will not stay back here. Ugh, stay. Okay. Thursday, like I said. Um, Valentine's Day, so I'm going to put that up top. I have these um, scripts from Scribble Prince Co. They're like all the holidays. And... I think I want to do a solid quarter box. I'm going to do the light one, the light pink, and put that in up top. And then I also have these like deco stickers from Scribble Prince Co. and JB Planning. JB Planning is no longer a shop, sadly, but I have this full sheet and I kind of want to use some. So I'm going to use this deco girl here with the balloons because I think that's really pretty um, and put in the script next to it to mark that it's Valentine's Day yay I think I am going to dinner this night but I don't know the specifics yet so I'm not gonna put anything in for that um, but I do know that I want to pre-plan so down here I'm gonna put in the red Actually, I'm going to put it this way. And the kit comes with a planner sticker. So I'm just going to use that one. And then I'm going to use the script from the Wiggle It Wednesday that says plan next week to mark that I'll pre-plan this day. And why is this so difficult? Now that my nails are so long I really need the help of the tweezers <laughs> so there's that that's a lot of space up top but it's fun it's dainty and cute um, okay so that's it for Thursday Friday the only thing for me to mark is payday so I'm gonna use this little label thing underneath here and then use some more of the Wiggle It Wednesday. I feel like this is the most that I've used a Wiggle It Wednesday, so I'm very proud of myself. Um, where did I put it though? Here. Um, so we'll do the script on this side, and then I'm going to use the mini icon of the bag of money. I wish I got paid with a bag of money because that would be fun. Um, but there's that. And then I will be getting new releases this week. I do know that because she put up her video. So I guess I could put in the new releases sticker, but I'll hold off on that just to see what else happens that day. Um, okay. And then I think I've put in everything else. There's not really anything going on this weekend. Um, I do have this Hello Weekend sticker though. Or like the weekend banner. Um, and I think I'm going to put it down here. In between the two washies. To blend it all together. That looks really cute. Okay. I guess it is time for the final reveal. To see how I feel about this spread. And all of its mixed craziness. Let me zoom you guys out. So you can judge with me. I think it helps a little bit that I was able to fill out. Monday and Tuesday, but there is kind of a wiggle. I don't know how good you can tell. I feel like the pink doesn't, like the pink foil doesn't show as much as like the other foil would, but I'm not mad about it. I think it looks really, really cute and really pretty. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and fill out what I have to fill out. I have a red and a black Sharpie pen, and then I have a, um, black and red G2. Um, so yeah. 
All right, guys, here is the finished product, and I'm not mad at it at all. It is definitely a different spread than I usually do, but that's always fun. I'm hoping that as the week goes along, I can better balance the gold and the pink foil, because there's a lot. I feel like it looks good over here, but I'm... I'm a little worried about this side, but we'll see how it turns out. Definitely follow me on my Instagram to see photos as this week progresses. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me show you what I have left of the kit. I used up all of the full boxes. We have some washi. We have some headers, little things, and boxes. More boxes on this with a habit tracker. And then we have the icons, flags, and check flags on there. So I will remember now. <laughs> that if I get a mini kit from her that I need to get the glitter headers and the date cover-ups as add-ons. I believe she offers them as add-ons anyway. I should have known. Um, but I do think her mini kit is perfect for the style that I plan, except for the fact that I need my date cover-ups. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you have not already. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys!